Hill Dixie Academy, where I went, where your mother and I went to college uh, and high school. I remember vividly, I mean vividly, the day that we, it was probably the first day or two of school of that term, but I was in the 10th grade and we heard that there was a new ninth grader, freshman, this beautiful, beautiful girl from Enterprise, Utah had moved here. Her name was Patricia Terry. And the word went out that uh, this beautiful, beautiful girl was here. And I didn't think I stood a chance to uh, know her or, or date her or whatever. I was really quite shy. Uh, and uh, so it- uh, You were <laughs> never shy. <laughs> so, and, right. and I have to just insert right here that I remember being our meeting each other quite differently than you have just heard him tell. Uh, school had been going for maybe three or four weeks before my parents had moved. And I remember the day that my father brought me to Woodward. The school looked huge to me after the little tiny school that I had attended in Enterprise. And the first person I think that saw me, or uh, he and his friend, um, started right then and, and there to tease me. He went about this courting exactly the wrong way, did all the wrong things. Sometimes. I never tease you. <laughs> no. And all the girls were in love with him. Oh and, he was <laughs> <laughs> and I remember I had been here only a few months when I wrote a letter back to my cousin who lived in Enterprise saying, I met this boy named Jeff Holland and he's the most overly confident, obnoxious person I've ever met. And I don't like him at all, but I have a deep feeling someday I'm going to marry him. <laughs> <laughs> well, and that's...